Let's talk about something that maybe you didn't know existed. I didn't know this product existed until I discovered it at a Goodwill store just yesterday as of this making of this video. You can see here we have the Insignia Infocast Internet Media Display. Convenient access to your internet. Compact wireless touchscreen access to your favorite parts of the internet. Over 1,500 free, <coughs> free apps and internet radio and no subscription fees. Now, since this product was first introduced, which apparently was around 2010-ish, um, it has a nickname also. Uh, let me add that as well. It's not only called the Infocast. That was Best Buy's name for it. It was also called the Chumby. And the Chumby is this little box you're looking at here, which is really just a glorified alarm clock. So just think of it as an alarm clock that attaches to the internet. And uh, here's the top speaker, like a snooze bar there. Volume control. And on the back here you have uh, a USB port, place for headphones, and there actually is an FM tuner inside. And there's an antenna tucked away in that compartment you see here. So it's a touchscreen device. It kind of reminds me of a GPS that you plug into the wall, but it's not a GPS. It just kind of has that feel to it as far as the, the touchscreen on the front. It's kind of, you know, you have to kind of mash on it to get it to do anything. But uh, I paid $6 for this. Apparently you can get them online for around $50. And this part right here has changed. There is now a subscription fee in order to get apps on the device. And uh, you can play music on it without a subscription fee. You can play FM radio without a subscription fee. And you can use it as a clock without a fee. Uh, the rest of the box kind of here touts all the other features. It includes a, a cleaning cloth, an AC adapter, quick setup guide, manual. Compatible with MP3s and DRM-free AAC music files. Plays flash video files. Oops, I'm looking at the wrong thing here. There we go. Plays flash video files. Compatible with USB flash drives, FM tuner, alarm clock, and 320 by 240 resolution LCD. So, um, interesting little toy. Um, to look at. I went ahead and signed up for a subscription via their website so that I could download some apps here and show them to you. Uh, it's got a very simple display on it, uh, or as far as operating system on it, pretty cryptic. You can create these little channels on here and then on each channel you can add different apps. So like uh, here's an aquarium app and click on that. And there you have something relaxing to look at. Little fake fishy swimming around in a blue pool. Um, by pressing the, the button on the top, that gets you back to this control panel. And then let's see what else we got here. There's AccuWeather, which I downloaded today. And of course, the good old clock that you can use. There's also a nighttime clock that you can get, or actually comes with it, I should say, so that at night you can just... Uh, barely see well in fact here it is right here night so there's the there's the nighttime clock and you can set the brightness on that as well so setup was fairly simple I don't know if you've ever used a harmony remote control but the setup was very simpler to simp almost as simple maybe simpler as setting up a harmony remote control you got to go to the chumby website which is at uh, chumby.com and once you sign up and pay your $3 a month, you can go into their store and you can buy little apps to download for it. So you get unlimited access to the apps for that $3 a month. So it's not really too horrible of a deal, really. Uh, you have to activate your device and you have to subscribe as well. You can activate it for free, but in order to put the uh, the apps on the device, you have to subscribe. The apps are called widgets. And uh, apparently there's different versions of this guy. There are ones made by the Chumby Corporation. If you go to their store 
here on their website, you'll see that there are bulkier looking versions of them. Sony apparently made one that had this operating system on it and uh, they have now completely separated themselves from this chumby uh, corporation. So uh, again, you can check that out for yourself on their website. But uh, just to look at kind of the, some of the apps that they have here, you can select a category of animals, animation, Australian, calendars, clocks, communications, community, educational, etc., 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 etc. Probably the most ideal use of this would be the uh, music, music and entertainment. Uh, let's look under entertainment what we got here. And then we select an app. We got AccuWeather and uh, Blockbuster Movies, Chinese Frankenstein's Ping Pong. Uh, what I was looking for actually is the uh, Pandora app. Let's see if it's under this category here. Yeah, well, there's Pandora Song Marks, uh, MTV News, Netflix. So I'm not sure if all of these are compatible with this device, but. Uh, in any case, quite a selection of different things. There's even shopping. So once you um, activate your device and add the apps that you want, then you have to reboot the device for it to look online and, um, and pull those apps in. And they appear instantly once you activate it. Uh, the device connects to your Wi-Fi network in your uh, house or a place of work, wherever you might be. And then you can download cool little apps and maybe set this on your desk and impress people and make them think you're really high tech and stuff. But um, in any case, that's really it. Um, I don't know if I would recommend one of these things unless you can get one for six bucks. But uh, if it's something you just have to have, like for example, just want to use it as a weather station to constantly monitor weather, uh, that might be worth it for that particular aspect. Or if you just want to use it as an internet radio, you could do that as well. The sound quality is not bad on this particular model, this uh, three and a half inch LCD screen model. Um, sound quality is pretty good and it's not stereo though. It is a one speaker outfit. So if you have any questions about this lovely little device, you may leave them below. And uh, I'm always looking for interesting gadgets to share with my subscribers. So please subscribe and leave a comment and share with a friend. And uh, I appreciate you watching.